Hello there, it's your friend Phil, project management trainer and coach. I am so delighted to introduce you to PM Data Flows. It's been a long time coming. This is my latest video product to help visual learners learn the ITTO and process relationships. It is such a visually compelling presentation that I would highly recommend it to anyone who is a visual learner struggling with relationships between PMBOK guide processes and inputs and outputs and not really understanding how the processes of the knowledge areas interact. You see, this will take you through three hours of visual learning. It will, first of all, lay the landscape with what I call the PM mainline, showing you how things come out of one process and they're used in so many other places. And it will then show you how other processes feed off these outputs and then generate their own outputs and how their own outputs relate with other processes. Sounds familiar? That's what the PMBOK guide is all about. But this is a visually compelling presentation, a visually compelling curriculum to help visual learners. So you can use this to augment your 35 contact hour course. If you're going for a 35 contact hour course and you want to know how everything fits together in the grand scheme of things, I would highly recommend this product. Just watch the videos, all the explanations are there. All of the visual reminders of these inputs and outputs, and you know we've got about 80 of these things that you need to remember. There is so much detail. I mean, you've got almost 80 inputs and outputs. You've got the 47 processes. You've got the five process groups, the 10 knowledge areas. Oh, we, we haven't even talked about the unending amount of tools and techniques you've got. <laughs> let's leave that for another day, but let's take a look here. Follow along in the PDF. The PDF has got the data flows as well, so you can follow along. I have also included in this presentation free samples of my book, PMP Exam IQ Test Workbook. And this will enable you find gaps in your knowledge regarding how inputs from one process can be used elsewhere, how outputs from one process can be used in the next, and so on and so forth. Be sure to take the final 50 question mock exam on the final page of that PDF. And I wish you all the best in your PMP prep. Take a look at what's coming next because I'm about to show you some samples of what exactly is in the course. Entire data flow, sections of the data flow that jump out at you where you discover a relationship that you hadn't previously identified. So let's move on. The next video that you'll watch, obviously, will be this one that goes through the entire data flow that you're seeing here. And after that, we will move into done. in those processes. So let's take them step by step. Let's take a look at direct and manage project work, for example. Direct and manage project work involves a lot of things. It involves work performance data as an output from here. It involves deliverables. But how do we know how to work this process? It's from the project management plan. How do we know how to work these other processes? It's from this plan. It tells us how And to. this is a recurring theme throughout the PMBOK guide. I want you to take a close look. This is what you're going to see in plan schedule management, plan risk management, plan cost management. In those knowledge areas in particular, you are going to see the project charter as an input. In plan scope, plan schedule, plan cost. Two very important outputs. One is called the resource breakdown structure from estimate activity resources. And the other is activity resource requirements. Now the resource input to plan communications management. Whatever exists as far as the project management plan is concerned will become an input to plan communications management. Norming, norming, performing, and adjourning. It's important that the project manager understands these five stages and plans 
how to develop the team so they could synergize effectively. Hello and welcome to Project Quality Management Data Flow Summary. Quality management is all about fitness for use and conformance to requirements, making sure that the product also as part of this course is samples of PMP exam IQ test workbook and samples of ITTO science power cards. Thank you very much for your audience. If you're interested in getting a download of this, follow the links below. Thank you for your audience and all the best on the PMP exam.